Hello and welcome to Sunday Afternoon Football. Anthony Hudson with you. Alongside me for this match will be Gary Lyon. Welcome, Gaz. What a game we've got today, Hutto. There really has been a big build-up for this clash. Hitting the turf today will be Fremantle and the Bulldogs. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp and the crowd are appreciating it. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. Western Bulldogs forwards. If they can get on top of the Dockers' defence, they'll go a long way to winning the game. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners are ready for the players. Prepare for the toss of the call. Western Bulldog winning the toss. Both sides look ready to get into the action. Just moments away now. And we kick off proceedings with the opening bounce. Fonten Pallet gets in the way. Finds his man. Has a man running for him. He's got the footy in his hands. Picked off the deck. A showing for number one. And he's missed. Trend goes looking for options now. Plays on. He drives it. Found space for an easy mark. Bonson Pallet puts it out on the full. He spears the ball. Wood hacking it out of there. Puts on a bump. Interesting handball. It's cut off by Williams. Richards gives the donut here. Richards just threw it. Looks to move it by foot. Intervening brilliantly was Collier. The ball spills free. Opportunity for English. Walters couldn't complete the tackle. Daniel was surrounded. He needed to mark it, and he did. Chips it towards half forward. Hunter wins the foot race. Giving it off was Collier. Gets around the imaginary opponent. He's got the footy in his hands. Walters going for number one. He's able to ride it home from a long way. He loved that one. Fremantle get the opening goal. The game is back underway. One down. Bonson Pallet did well not to fumble. Showing some really good pressure there. Slams it onto the booth. Blakely the better man there. Stabs at the kick. Off hands from Wallace. Moved on by Wilson. The ball spills to Richards. Just sends it into space. The ball spills from the tackle. Releases by hand. Use the hands and gives away the free. Duray drives the kick. Try to avoid everything out there. Richards slick with the hands. The kick releases the pressure. Williams pushes his opponent off with one hand. Bruce used the body to take that mark. Looks with hands. Wood keeps coming. Putting his skills on display. Just gets it onto the boot. Mundy just put it on the boot. Ryan with the intercept. Picked off by Wallace. Kicks long for goal and misses. Not many players can make it from that distance. Western Bulldog keeping in touch. Darcy to bring it in. 
Wilson didn't mark it. Finds the loose ball. Ball collected. Hurry kick. Drops the ball. We'll get a ball up on the wing. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. Picks up the loose ball. A quick handball from Banfield. Terrific mark there. 40 metres from home. Going for goal number one. Chalk a goal up the three men. McCarthy getting the crowd involved. Fremantle have kicked back-to-back -back goals. Now they lead by 12. Wins the ruck duel. Brayshaw grabbed it clean. Lobs the handball. He has the ball. He sums up the situation and delivers. He's absolutely loving it. Why not? Bike loves that goal. Now they lead by 18. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. Back in the middle, has the rucks go at it. Law farmed it down. Puts it on the boot. Wood has it. With a driving kick. The contest, no match for him. I agree with you there, Hutto. Fremantle are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Releases the handball. Nice work from Collier. Gets him a reward for his efforts. Fremantle, 25, played Western Bulldogs. One, thump by English. Liberatore goes through the tackle. Just through the ball. Uses it now. Good mark. And looks to send it back. Uses it across half back. The mark is taken by Joe Hennison. Elects to kick. Chera there to mop up. Off the ground. He's kicked the goal. The pressure continues to mount. With that goal from Patera, his teammates rush over. He did really well there and gets the reward. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. Back with another centre bounce. Long on the tap. Collier onto the ball. Picked up now. Ball stripped in the tackle. Dale releases by hand. Gets a quick kick away. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Tries to gain some territory. McRae got under it. Uses it by foot. The bounce made it tough. Linking by hand. Ryan got hands to it. Listen to the fans celebrate as he drives that through. No doubt about it. That's the first goal of the day for Pontempelli. Celebrating hard. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. That's a really good team goal. We resume hostilities. Long got in the better position. Collects the loose ball. Mundy handballs. Back now from Collier. Hit the man hard. This is Wood. Duray finds a way to hang on. Great tackling technique. Caught napping and it's holding the ball. Gowers gets wrapped up by Darcy. Big tackle. A chance to reload the attack now. Got boot to ball. Ends up turning his ball over. 50 metres from home. He slams it towards goal. Hunter spills it. Gaz, what are your thoughts on that opening turn? Fremantle have come to play. They've got themselves in the game and need to push on now. 
both sides might want to work on their defence after a high-scoring opening term. Gowers on top of the ranking points. He is dominating this game. We're ready for second quarter action. About to resume hostilities. Thrashes it. Has it now. A clean pickup. He gets his hands on the footy. Ends up marking uncontested. Slams it on the boot. Easily takes the mark. Fremantle have the lead, but they're allowed plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of the game if they're to stay on top. Walters kicks it out of bounds on the full. Keeps it moving. He wins possession. The handball now from Richards. Getting pushed out of the way was Cox. Big chance to score from this inside 50 stoppage. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'd love for the coach to send a message out there and tell these players to take the game on. Goes by hand. He's got the football now. Seen plenty of it. The umpire will ball it up. Lock with a big fist on it. Lock gets onto the ball. Bonson Pally controlled it well off the bounce. Looks to move it by foot. Goes off the deck. In front. Hunter puts his first goal on the ball. He's excited about that one. Western Bulldogs could kick back to back goals. They have lifted their intensity. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. Brayshaw has the ball. They can link up now. Great attack on the ball carrier. Darcy gets on the end of that handball. Banfield takes it well. He drives it. A chance to gather the ball. Kicks hurriedly. Just gets a boot to it with quick hands. Handballs to a teammate on the run. Intercepts the ball well. Manages to get a hand to it. Kolya flicks it over. Just gets the kick away. Trengo scoops it up. He can take off after that handball. McCarthy dug out the loose ball. Ball gets cut off. Now we will get a ball up. Clears the contest. Williams off the deck. Norton gains possession. My ball, says the umpire. English hurls it away. Handball's under pressure. Is in his possession. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. Gets the handball away. Cox cuts it off. Can already tell that's not so good. He looks injured. That doesn't look great. Looks unlikely he will see any further action. That's true, Rado. Scoops it up. He takes aim. Darts it through for another. Gets his first. He acknowledges the crowd. That's three in a row for Western Bulldogs. They're starting to get on top at the minute. Kolya moves it by hand. Dishes it off to a player on the run. And now, we'll have a ball up. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of football. Constant pressure and rewarded. Wood had it, lost us. Mops up the loose ball. A good job keeping it in play there. Gets it away under pressure. The Dockers doing well at the moment.
Fremantle have turned it over too often today. They aren't coping with the pressure. They should try and slow it down and control the ball for a moment. Lucky to be on the receiving end of that decision. McCarthy going for number two. Fremantle, 33. Lead Western Bulldogs, 19. Trengo with the kick in duties. Decides to play on. Kicks it out of the defensive 50. Couldn't snaffle it. Well collected. Going for goal number one. That one hits the ground. Fremantle by 15 points. Looking to bring it back into play. Gets into some space to mark this. Kick by Wood. Hogan quickly onto the boot. Ball off hands. Thank you. Thumps it clear. They can create from this. Wood struggling to run at the moment. McLean gives it to the player running pass. Takes possession. Gowers gets a quick kick away. What a kick, and he puts it through. That will settle the nerves. Gets his first on the ball. They get around him after that effort. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Western Bulldogs need to find the ball more. If they can get their hands on the ball, then they can start to create some chances. What can you tell us, Gaz? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. Suckling manufactures a handball. Goes by hand to Gowers. Wilson can create on the turnover. Ends up with Ryan. He takes the mark. Fremantle for allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Pierce comes away with the ball. A chance to put one through for his side. Banfield right on the edge of his range. Going for goal number one. That's a really poor finish there. Have to find a way to do better. The margin is 10. Teammates break for him. Good mark there. Wants to keep moving. Can't take the mark. It's been turned over. Slams it onto the boot. Norton gets on the end of this. Uses it now. And the mark will be paid. The kick from Dunkley. Hunter looking to track down the footy. Ryan shows some physicality. Going for goal number two. Congratulated by his teammates. Western Bulldogs have five unanswered goals. Western Bulldogs close the gap to four. That's it for the first half. What can you tell us, Gaz? The Dockers will go into the rooms at halftime with plenty of confidence and back themselves for the second half. Nobody can hold on here. Gary, does anything stand out in the stats? It really hurts Fremantle when you aren't able to convert chances in... The third quarter about to get underway. About to resume play. Lob thrashes it. Conquer rushes with the kick. Intercepted. Quick handball. Lob throws the ball away. Wallace moves it now. Norton drops the mark. Conkick wants to keep it moving by hand. Hands that ball to the opposition. Outstanding pressure. Wants to keep it moving. Jeray links up with a chance to run. Wilson puts it on the boot. Dug out by McLean. A bit too hard with a push. And it's a free kick. Puts it on the boot. It's marked by Law. 
Releases by hand. Almost cut it off. Use the hands and gives away the free. Going for distance with the kick. Wood. Marks uncontested. 45 metres out. They'll regain the lead if he nails this one. Wood celebrates with the fans. They've taken the lead. Pierce thrashes it. Hurry kick. Jeray missed an opportunity to mark. They could take the lead here. Summed it up and he delivers perfectly. Look at him, he really enjoyed that one. Fremantle are back in front. We're back in motion. Swatson. The ball in the hands of Bruce. Dunkley marks. Moves the ball by foot. He takes the mark. Daniel plays it on. Tucker just manages to release the kick. He puts it out of bounds on the full. Advantage. Decides to kick. Good mark there. Puts boot to ball. Takes an uncontested mark. A spearing kick. Finds himself in space and marks. Marks now and can send it back. Moves it by foot. Nice work from Hogan. Got boot to ball. Wood didn't mark it. Tabernard collects it. Scoops up the ball. Just put it on the boot. Chera takes it strongly. 30 metres out, lining up from a 45 degree angle. Moving on. Going for goal number one. Oh, what about that? That was really special. Chera loved kicking that one. 10 points the difference. Back in the middle now. Lock with a big fist on it. Tucker made the tricky bounce look easy. Handballs. Has a man running for him. He gains possession. Hogan going for number one. He's put it through. Look at them celebrate that effort. The lead is now 16. We're back in the middle now. Lord thumped it clear. Gets on the end of this. Walters making his way onto the field. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Can you tell us anything at the moment, guys? I'm really enjoying this one, Harold. Collier slams it onto the boot. The mark is taken by Tabernard. Might be too far out to score. Going for goal number one. Good mark and looks to send it back. Trengo elects to kick. Intercepts the ball well. Tucker puts it on the boot. The ball goes over the boundary line. Deep inside 50. Ball over the boundary line. Toss back into play. Lord clears the contest. With the ball now. Creatively finds a way past. Libertore heads onto the ground. The umpire will throw it back in. The ball is coming back into play. English won the hit out. Did well to control the ball. Williams throws the ball away. He doesn't want to let his teammates down with this shot at goal. 45 metres out. Matera gets for home. It's a behind. Fremantle 54. Lead Western Bulldogs 37. Considering the options on the kick in. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Tucker, the long way out, slams it on the boot. Turned it over. Dishes it off. Fighting hard was Liberatore. Intercepted by Matera. The loose ball picked up. Has a runner alongside him. Might be a bit of an injury for Williams. Going straight to the rooms. Doesn't look good. Handballs to a teammate on the run. Goes off the ground. Found a way to keep balance. Richards releases the ball. Rushes with the kick. Takes a simple grab. Suckling sends one up towards the wing. 
A chance to reload the attack man. Drives towards half forward. The ball goes over the line. Advantage pay. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Did well not to confuse himself. Releases the handball. Well, it'll be a ball up near the boundary line. Piers just swats it away. Gains some territory. Darcy gathers it now. Dunkley now. Gow down some space and marked. 35 metres out. Might run around and open up the angle. As we go into the final change, the scores are Fremantle 54, Western Bulldogs 37. A big final term coming up. Fremantle fans will be hoping they can hold on and get a memorable victory today. What can you tell us from the stats, Gaz? Fremantle can't kick him straight. If they don't start to take these opportunities, they can watch this lead slip away. Thanks, Gary. Time to find out what happens in this final turn. They need to get a move on if they're going to win from here. Thump clear. He wins possession. English just gets it onto the boot. Uses the hands instead of the body, and it's a free kick. Channels a long kick. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's barely touched the ball. Bottom power gets towards the goal. He celebrates hard after that. Just under two goals, the difference now. Great bit of play that resulted in that goal. He did really well there and gets the reward. It's quite simple. Fremantle won more of the ball and have been able to create more opportunities in front of goal. Fremantle needs to do a better job and gain more clearances at the moment. They're getting beaten in the contest and it's affecting the scoreboard. He 
has to hold on to those. English not getting much of it, Gaz. He needs to find a way into this game. Manufactures the handball. Keeps it alive under some pressure. Up for grabs for English. Well collected. Wallace kicks hurriedly. The kick from McRae. Matera couldn't keep his hands on it. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. He's barely touched the ball lately. Spills the mark. McCarthy puts on a big hit. Just makes it. Fremantle go back the Bulldogs by 12. Unsure of their next move. Trend goes, plays on, gets it away. Suckling slams it onto the boot. Wins the race to the ball. Picks up the loose ball. Tabernak is it off. A chance for Matera. No issues with that drop. A second goal in the bag. He's enjoying that goal. 18 points the difference. Umpire ready to resume play. Thrashes it. Uses the bump. The loose ball picked up. Fife dug it out. Pushes off the tackler. Elects to kick. What a tackle. A great defensive effort. Banfield picks up the loose ball. A chance to put a second goal on the ball. Banfield with a poor kick out of play. Dunkley coming onto the ground. Looks up with the kick. Taking a nice grab. Walters will have to put everything into this one. They're doing really well to choose some time off the clock here. Looking to kick goal number two. That looked great. What a goal. Pretty happy with that one. Fremantle, but 24. Back in the middle to resume play. Hammers it. Has it now. English needs a chance to rest. Hacking it out of there. Off hands from Suckling. Finds the loose ball. Sends it clear of the contest. Off hands. Cox kicks hurriedly. The loose ball scooped up. Ace goes to the man on the run. Does a 360 around the tackler. Fantastic chase and tackle. Fantastic tackle. A chance to put a second goal on the ball. Through for a minus goal. Fremantle, Clee is now 25. Fremantle have been poor with their ball use. They've turned it over on too many occasions, and it's allowing the opposition chances to score. Shaggy just throws it. McCarthy with a chance to light things up. Fremantle have kicked the last three goals. This margin is becoming a bit of a task to peg back now. Off the deck. Using every ounce of energy he has left. He heads for home. Pinpoint accuracy from Tucker. He loved that one. Margin starting to really blow out. English trumps it forward. Goes short by hand. Dunkley pushes through with power. Collier got hands to it. Five just landed in his back. Moved on by English. Does well to cut off the kick. Walters with a shorthand pass. Ryan gets it away under pressure. Dale with a chance on the turnover. Gathered by Daniel. Liberatore looks in need of a spell. He delivers with a drop punch and delivers with a desperately wounded goal. He's excited about that one. Western Bulldog now only trailed by 31. Punched away. English comes away with the ball. Got the hands free. With the ball now. Gets around the imaginary opponent. Lloyd doesn't take the mark. Sends it home. A time to celebrate, and don't they get around Daniel. Western Bulldog have kicked the last two goals. Western Bulldog behind by 25. 
Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? This game needs a spark at the moment. My ball, says the umpire. Clears the contest. Cleanly picked up. The umpire will ball it up. Punches are clear. Just goes bang. He just throws that ball. Uses it by foot. Darcy runs after the ball. Dale gets the loose ball. Daniel looking to put through another goal. He gains possession. Lloyd ran it best. He slots this one. A big goal there. They get around him after that effort. Western Bulldogs have three in a row. They're finding a way back into this. Winning it was Bruce. Spins past with determination. Fife can't hold on to the tackle. Keeps it moving. Dale mobs the handball at full stride. Receives the handball. Punches it clear. Scoops up the ball. Listen to the roar of the fans. They love that decision. Ryan missed an opportunity to mark. Missed the target. He's on fire at the moment, Gaz. You're right, Hutto. He's an absolute ball magnet. Walters couldn't snap it. They can create from this. Darcy throws the ball away. Fremantle, go home, please, after competing well for a win today. One side just wanted it more, and they deserve to get the result. Here's the final scores. Fremantle, 80, versus Western Bulldogs, 61. Thanks for joining us. As always, it's been a pleasure. We look forward to seeing you back soon. Well, thanks for having me. That's all we have time for. We'll see you next time.